Every now and then, the golfing gods throw up a golf course that you just can't quite believe exists. Today we're at Killspindy Golf Course. This place looks absolutely spectacular. We are, of course, in the next 100 series, two pros, 18 holes. What can we score at this stunning golf course? Let's get to the opening tee. Okay guys, first hole here at Killspindy, the opening hole of par three, 161 yards playing, stroke index 13. What a gorgeous view back out into the estuary. Well bunkered to that right hand side if you do go short as well. Chris, let's start off with a bo bogey, with a hopefully not. Chris, let's start off with a birdie and get underway. Great strike, it's just going to the right a touch. Flush that. I'm not sure if you had enough club there, I think you tried to force the, force the issue. That was a good layup. It's fading. Get up. Oh, it's, yep. it's over the trap. Right, so par three open, very interesting here at Killspindy. Now, this is one of the courses that I'd never really heard of before when we approached this challenge. This is, of course, the Next 100 Tour. We are taking on the Next 100 Greatest Golf Courses here in the UK and Ireland. It's a big challenge, and so far, I'm really enjoying it. Can we get to eight under? Can we tie the top of the leaderboard? Can we shoot nine under as a scramble? Myself and Chris, two PGA pros, get to the top of that leaderboard and displace Dunbar at the top. This place looks all right, Chris, doesn't it? It looks fantastic. Again, I hadn't heard of it either. No, right. Um, I'll go first. It's a, it is a birdie attempt, even though two tame tee shots, really. Home ball birdie, straight yeah. on the first. Four shot. Stay up. Good pace. Yeah, not too bad. bad. Same as you. Uh, not bad. Yeah, a bit better than mine. Not bad. So far, good weather. We've only had one bad day's weather. Don't that was... say that now. This is bleak. Is it gull? Well, I'm not expecting rain today. Really? <laughs> Beautiful out here. Par on the first hole. See. Right guys, second hole, as you can see, there is ocean all to the right of us. It is a par five, over 500 yards, stroke index five. You do not want to go right here. It's actually out of bounds as well. Then as you get up to the green, it is well bunkered. What a fantastic looking hole this is. Chris, take us away. That is a great shot. Awesome golf shot. Where did it go? Straight out middle, <laughs> never moved. <laughs> Sit. Right there. We'll see. You literally have four holes to the left and I go and dice it with the out of bounds. Mm, touch and go. Yeah. Guys, if you're enjoying this series, please make sure you do consider hitting that subscribe button. Also, huge thanks to the guys at Tacomo and the guys at Seed Golf who are supporting us on our journey to play these next 100 greatest golf courses. It's the challenge of a lifetime. Make sure you subscribe and throw a like on this video so you don't miss any of it, guys. Can we shoot nine under? We've got the weather. We have got the weather. You're never going to get this on a better day, are you? No. That might be a seed down. Uh, if you watched last week's episode at the Fidra course at Archerfield, we have said you never leave a good seed behind. I don't think we've got an option there. I think that one's going to stay there, isn't it? At least you're in play there, Chris. Look at this Great drive. Well. Cracking dog. Just love. Right, Chris, 255 yards into the wind. Let's see what we can do with this. Yeah, it needs all of it. And more. And another one. Can we get there in two? Great shot. Don't think it's going to get there. No. That's... I think it's the perfect layup. Yeah. Yeah, just short. Right, new ball required for Robinson. New balls, please. New balls. New balls, boy. That's a cracking shot. Is it up? Oh. It's flirting. Oh, it's trying. Trying, I'm not sure. I've also treated myself to a new glove for the occasion okay. today as well. See, glove, we've got those in the bag. Mine's living on, it's doing How a good job. How many rounds? Is that four rounds? Four rounds, but not only that, it's seen some weather as we Yeah, I'll, in fact, I'll throw some weather on from our episode two at Gullen. Don't we mind the other day. What episode four already? How mental is that? I don't 
don't know, 96, 96 to, go. to go. Wow. Closing in. Chris, I got fairly close. You're back here. What do you want to do? Is, is my chip easier to think? Or yeah, we'll take yours. It looks hold on, good. let me check if we're still in the bunker or not, because the beauty about Lynx Golf, sometimes you... Oh, we're all right. Are we good? Yeah, we've got to lie. Right. All right, ball above feet. It's going to move a little bit in the air, but not too much. Up and down birdie. The great shot all I've heard is me with my bottle on that swing, to be honest. <laughs> Can I just say, we've been using the Tacoma Skyforger 001 wedges on this trip so far, and they are really, really growing on me. I absolutely love the bounce that you've got on this 56. I absolutely love you've got a little bit more weight in at the top, so you can flight them down like that. And I'm actually really getting to like that leading edge. I didn't like it at first. I thought it was too rounded. It sits nice, doesn't it? And it's they're spinning up just like a premium wedge would. Ooh, Two good, good chips. Had to get it past. Right, we'll tap yours in. It's not a birdie on my own, because that would have been a panic, Chris, wouldn't it? They're the rules in this series, but it is a birdie. Ah, oh, look at the nice goose. That's a lovely, is that a goose? Is it, yeah? Duck, duck, goose. Very nice, very nice. One under. Okay, guys, fresh off the back of that birdie, we have a 410-yard par four. Stroking next one, the hardest hole on the golf course. Once again, do not go right. This hole is named Arthur's Seat, and just look how dangerous this could end up being to your scorecard. Let's see if we can escape here with a par, or even try and get ourselves a birdie. One under par. Great shot, Chris. I mean, there's three stakes, I've just gone for the middle one. Yeah, great shot. Certainly low in, well, certainly low in, certainly launching lower and staying lower that ball, as we saw previously at Gullen. Yeah. Compared to Archerfield in the Pines last week. There's the X one. He's, he's flirting again. Flirting? Flirting. Might need a minute on Arthur's seat at this rate. I thought that was good. What if you're a duck? Now, I must admit, looking at this place, this is my kind of place. Something that not a lot of people will have heard of. Guys, if you have heard of it or even played it, get in the comments below and let us know. If you haven't done, I'll put a link in the description to the golf course. If you're ever up in this area, it, I mean, it's, well, we've got the course to ourselves almost. It's fantastic, it, fantastic condition. But like I say, when you come here to Gull and you, it might be one that you miss off. Yeah. Right, let's see where they are. Right, mine well, was safe, just in the semi-rough. Chris, yours is in the left-hand semi-rough. What do you want to do? This looks like a good angle in. Yeah, That's better right. angle because we're missing the bunker out, aren't we? I'll collect mine. 170. Is it? That is stroke index one. Yeah. That would mean that's only gone 250 off a tee. Yeah, that's probably right into the wind, to be fair. Right, I'm going to go with a six, chip it down there. Looks like it kind of runs down into the green, doesn't it? Yeah. Just pulled it a bit. Oh, Not that's long. What did you hit? Six. It's like a chippy one, and it's quite long. Not bad. Yeah, a little bit left as well. What a view. All right, um, this is literally the best of the bunch. Which is worrying. I thought yours was good, but it caught that bunker. Just caught the bunker, otherwise it was going to feed down. Right, uh, 60 degree it is. Trying to carry it all the way. I think it will see. Buggy straight behind, is that to save the uh, SD05? Oh, we've lost one. <laughs> Sit. Mm, not bad. Yeah. Uphill port, we know. Touch that. aggressive, but. I'll be good. Chris Dennis, stop it. Take a bow, son. That'll do, Sky Forger. <laughs> Pa. Okay, guys, fourth hole, 370 yard, par four, stroke index nine. 
a lovely feature on the left hand side and again you do not want to go right here you are in the water you are out of bounds par on stroke index one wasn't the worst thing chris let's see if we can claw it back and get another birdie one under par yeah great shot just towards that little castle thing hmm little draw there i'm gonna start at the castle and just cut it back Should work. Well, we did find mine. Unfortunately, it was in the rough in a bad lie. So we're going to go with Chris's in the fairway. Another fairway hit, Chris. Mm. What do we have? We have 142 to the flag. To what a green this is. So far, this is one of the favourite courses I think I've played. Not just in this series, but this is like a this happy place. This is one place. of my favourite links courses I've played. Yeah. We think well, chippy, chippy seven. I've got eight. Yeah, chippy seven. We've one thing I've really been enjoying about these 301 CBs is the ability to play it down on Lynx courses. If you are doing, not all the courses in this series will be Lynx. Obviously, it's the top, well, 100 to 200 courses in the UK and Ireland. A lot of them made up of Lynx courses, but a lot of inland, Heathland. A bit of everything, isn't there, really? Parkland, we'll get to some of those very soon in the series. After we've taken care of Kill Spindy. Delightful. Flag high? Yeah. And for it's one of those holes where it looks like it goes straight into the water. It's just glorious. Being able to play that shot with a, a little CBIN forged, yes please. Right, two good shots into this green. See if we can try and make a birdie, get to two under. The best we've had on nine holes in the series so far was at Dunbar, three under, and at Fidra. And? Were they three under for all of it? Thank Gullen. Yeah, so can we get three under or can we beat it? It's a fantastic. I just keep showing you the views, to be honest, because it's just. I imagine when it's raining, it's a bit more bleak. Yeah, but... like Gullen was. Yeah, that was bleak, wasn't it? Lovely course, though. Beautiful, I will be back. Right, are we taking mine? No. Nope. That's mine, isn't it? That's mine. No, three. correct. Well done, Chris. Good shot, sir. I'm actually on for a home ball birdie. Yeah? I'll have you know. First <laughs> one at Kill Spindy. Make your own birdie. You get a pint in the badger. We didn't have one, did we, at Fidra? Did we? No, we didn't. We, we didn't... <laughs> We dovetailed well, but we didn't really have any standout performances. We didn't hit it anywhere near the hole, unfortunately. Well, he's not hit it. I mean, it was in the middle. Speaking of standout performances, I was absolutely shit-faced after uh, Dunbar with my four standalone birdies. Pop it out, Chris, watch this. Out. Yeah. That's your own fault, that. You brought that on yourself, striding yeah, after it. Flag out just changed my mindset totally. To positive. Yeah. Par. Okay guys, fifth hole, just 289 yard, par four, stroke index 15. You can see this hole is incredibly well bunkered. And again, you may get bored of hearing this, but a spectacular view once you get up to that green. We're one under par, can we press on? I'm gonna send one away and let's see if we can just start turning that screw a little bit. Chris, I'm gonna go driver, because why not? Why not? Okay, that's, that's, that'll be why not. I think it's safe. Yeah, that was bad. It's exactly the same as mine. If we find one, we'll find them both. Right, in a strange twist of events, uh, we're actually aiming for the wrong flag and yeah, we're I not think, that far away from the right one. I think the red flag's a back nine and the yellow flag's a front nine. So we've actually done quite well there. Yeah, it's closer <laughs> than we thought. 50 yards, I'm on a bit of a path as well. It's 
good. Oh, that could be really good. It's gonna be close. <gasps> oh, Chris, I tell you what, is it close? I wish I'd have run to see how that went. I can't really run, but I'm gonna say you don't really mean that. Not built for speed, but that's very close. Oh, it's a flighted one. Oh! It was right on line. Yeah, it was. Great effort. Did it nip up? Did nip up quite a lot. Hmm. I am liking these wedges. Yeah. I hate to break it to you, Chris, but you know what that's for. Yeah. Well, it's a birdie. Let's get to the badger. I've not hold it yet, to be fair, but we were definitely aiming for the wrong flag. Yeah. That's why I couldn't see one. You can only see that because it's dark, isn't it? There's a beer on the line. Robinson's there. Especially a free one. Tastes even better. Oh, side door. So there's a side door to the Badger as well, Chris. See you there. Thanks. Three under. Sixth hole, another nice short one. 281 into the wind this time. Stroke index 17. Back to the normal order. Chris, you can see it is heavily bunkered down there. And again, what a spectacular view looking out over to that estuary. What colour flag is it? Uh, this one is a yellow flag, I can see it. Just to... Be good. It's got a thread through the bunkers. Ooh, in the green side one. <sighs> now, I'm going to hit iron just in case. It's If that's up against the lip and then I go and put it in one, we're in trouble, aren't we? It doesn't feel like the best swing, but it's his job. Or iron. Just out to that left side, play a nice little low one. That's the shot. Like that. These long irons really are fantastic. Great shot. Right, mine's back in the fairway. It's probably about 80 yards. I mean, we've got a difficult shot to cover that bunker anyway. We're going to assess Chris's, see if we can get that sky forge a lot. Oh, that's exactly why I hit Ooh. iron. Uh, huh? No. No. I'll collect that yeah. and we'll go back to yours, my friend. Perfect. We have 85 yards playing 87. <laughs> Just go full lob wedge here, do you think? Now, I've got 56. We're into the wind, so that should help, shouldn't it? Pull this close, it could be two in the badger. Go. Go. Oh, James. Oh, be good. Be good thinking that could be good we put a camera up at the green and the exact reason we said was james would probably miss the green all right chris this to go three under just outside right all about pace mm. oh delightful i feel like these are holes you do need to birdie in a scramble because they're not overly difficult yeah we've got to three under early for a change anyway, three holes left front nine Seventh hole, just 382 par four, stroke index three. Once again, you can't go right here. This is playing downwind. You can see how well bunkered it is, just like the rest of the holes on this, let's face it, fantastic golf course. Chris, take us away. We're three under par. We are rocking and rolling. Great shot. Great shot, sir. Down the... That is literally down the middle stripe, isn't it? Middle. Where's that been all week? That's a great drive. Miss that bunker, please. Mm. <laughs> it's got in that bunker, isn't it? It might be too good that it's I absolutely bunker. nailed that as well. I'll have a look and see if mine has miraculously... No, it's not. Yeah. It's, um, it's right in that top bunker there. Right in the middle of it. Right, Chris. Pedal to the metal. What have we got? 34. 34. You know what? I'm thinking about just a nice little chippy nine iron, try and really control that flight, let it release out a little bit, rather than just trying to absolutely smash it into next week. Shall I go? Go ahead. Like that. That's a great looking shot. Go on, get up there. Get up there! Oh. Like a false front, isn't there? Grabbed. It was a good shot. Yeah, I really enjoyed it. <laughs> a full or skull. Sit. <laughs> right, Chris, shall I have a go while you uh, retrieve yours? Yeah, it's still a long way, I think. I've hit that so hard. Come on, pace good. Two cups left. Yeah, it wasn't. It was just straight. 
I'll tell you what, Chris, it feels like we're the only people on this entire golf course at the moment. That is a feeble effort. Yeah, it wasn't your best. No. Heads a shed. After that, thing to win. Bar. Oh, moving on. Three under. Eighth hole, 166 yard par three, stroke index 11. This is, there's only one word for this. This is absolutely stunning. Just look at the view we've got here towards that green. If ever you would want a hole in one, this is where you would have it. Three under par. Chris, can we keep this moving into the back nine? Take it away. It's a lovely safe golf shot. Boring. Yeah. I mean, it's bang smack middle of the green. It's lovely. <sighs> In my head, I was drawing that off the water. I am going to do just that. I'm going to aim 10 yards right of it. The wind's off the water anyway. That is a cracking shot. If it's there, oh, yeah. it's there. Oh, it's there. Good shot. Now, this may well be one of my favorite golf holes I've ever played. If I do say so myself, I'm quite pleased with that golf shot as well. You can just see how spectacular these views are. If you get out onto the ocean and really see just how sculpted this green is and the woodwork around it. Chris, it's just stunning, isn't it? It is a fantastic hole, but you wouldn't like it if that wind was uh, howling off the right. No, I bet there's been some big clubs hit into here. Let's see if we can convert this to a birdie too. Was for another one, Chris in the Badger. Oh, that was lovely. Oh. <laughs> well, it was at it. It's positive. It went off in my hand there. Great roll. Guys, that is three under part through eight holes. Again, the comments below. Can we get to the top of the leaderboard here at Killspindy? I'm having the time of my life and really enjoying it. Guys, if you're enjoying it too, smash that subscribe button. This is the busiest schedule of our lives. 100 golf courses, and this is only number four. Okay, guys, ninth hole, 308 yard par four, stroke index seven, up the hill, round to the corner. Really well bunkered. Interestingly, you're not allowed to try and hit it more than 250 yards on this hole. I've never heard that on a golf course before, but what a stunning hole it is. Chris, let's lead us away. We're just gonna try and nudge this down there then. Nice. I hope that four iron's not going over 250 yards. Fingers. You'd be in trouble. Fingers crossed, they'll be after me. Yeah. Good shot. Got two pretty safe tee shots there, either side of the cut line. We're definitely not disturbing that house, which I imagine is what that signpost is for. Mm. Um, which one do you fancy? I think we'll take this one on the left. I think this is mine, but we've got a bit of an easier shot in. No problem. Two here. Okay, 84 yards, playing 94 yards with slope. Let's try and attack it. It's at it if it's the right club. Nice, should be good, should it? I think it should be. Thank yeah. you very much. Try and get this nice and high, get the landing angle from being down in the bottom of this swale. That could be nice, you know. But it might be long. Hmm, good line. Yeah, I got it high as well, which I've tried to do, so. I'll let you put those back. Thank you, sir. Well, yeah, you did, but we'll swatch them out. <laughs> little, little jump step. Little double dip. That busy looking at the houses, we forgot to look at the golf balls. They're two pretty good shots. And that is to break our record of three under through nine Ooh, holes. What a lovely par three. The, nice. There hasn't been a bad hole yet. No, I've awesome. thoroughly enjoyed every single hole on this Kill Spinny golf course. Yodi. Very friendly shots there. Very, very friendly. Right, going with the bottom one. I think so, for home ball birdie. Yeah, that is you, I'm a number one. So you landed here, interesting enough, obviously, stopped with landing angle. Mine pitched just on the green and stopped probably within three, four yards, maybe. Yeah, mine was landing angle, yours was spin, wasn't it? So, good reaction from this SD05 can get the flight and the spin. I can't imagine you getting this golf course on an easier day, by the way. No, we've been very fortunate with here and Dunbar and Archfield. Just not going. 
Oh, it's a ball outside. There's no beer in the badger for me. Oh, leave that in there. How do you want it? Oh, he wants it in. He's off. Oh! oh. I thought it was another <laughs> lip out. Get that in slow mo. Full 360. Get the fans. Guys, that is four under oh, through the front nine here at Kill Spindy. Like I said, it's playing playable today, is what I'll say. Imagine 10 miles an hour, 15 miles an hour, more wind, it's a bit more difficult. But let's get our foot down, see what we can score, and set a precedent for the top of this next 100 leaderboard. Okay guys, 10th hole measuring 151 yards, par 3 struck and extend downhill, well bunkered at every corner as you can see. Let's see if we can really keep this momentum going now. All the par 3s here so far have been stunning, really, really enjoyable, just nice distances and quite small greens to try and attack. Chris mm. leaders away, let's see if we can get this foot down and get to 5 under. Well, I'll tell you what, he's never had a hole in one. What a day it would be. And it's not today. Not yet, anyway. That's the club, just a little bit short. Go. Go. Exactly the same. Social. Yeah, we've tried to get too cute with that, really. Yeah, two pretty poor attempts there. Yeah. We'll have a go at mine, I think. I'll try and... Send one in with this little Skyforger 56, which is in your bag. Oh, yeah. All right, into the wind, so should be able to get a little bit of check here. I don't know if that was a club shot there, I've just tried soaring too much off. Yeah, I think it's the right club. We just took too much off, and it is a bit into the breeze. Well, it was aggressive. Club, aggressive. Have yeah. moved? Shame, because it feels like that was an opportunity at such a short yardage. Well done. Good three. 11th hole, 293 yard par four, stroke index 18. This should be effectively the easiest hole on the golf course. Do we lay up of that big cavernous bunker on the right, or do we try and send driver straight over it? Chris, we are on a roll. I'll let you go first. Team captain, send us away. Oh, it's a bullet. Stay there. I think it's over the bunker. That's right. Man. Terrible goal swinging. Right, I think you're safe. I'll have a go. Oh dear. Never the words you want to hear. <laughs> At that house with a bit of fade. Yep. Also the words you never want to hear. A bit of a double cross, one would say. Right, well, I was kind of nearly up there with it. Chris, I think yours is going to be better. We haven't seen it yet, but hmm. I think it's got to be an easier way in than this. That was close to the sea, actually. Mm. Took it all in. Didn't even know that was in play on this hole. Chris's was nearly in what's known as a brick uh, boo house. Lavatory. And I've got the Double. Skyforger 60. This is what we're left with. You can really start to imagine how difficult this plays when there's a lot of wind. Hmm. Oh, that landed delightfully. That's in. Oh, that was for on your own eagle. Oh, what do we get for that? Should we get a birdie from there? So it could be aggressive. That is aggressive. That's all the way in. Yes. Oh, oh my God. Cracking effort. I'll give you that. And it's not yours out of the way. <laughs> right, so James is not mine out of the cover? way. There's a head cover on there. That could be my head cover, actually. I've never seen that done before, but I think it is yours because I've noticed you've not got it on. Oh. Very good thinking of someone to pop it on there. Well, the sun is out for us. For a birdie. Five under through ten. Eleven. Eleven. Oh. So, guys, 12th hole, another short one, 270 yard par four, stroke index eight, out of bounds up the right hand side. This is incredibly well bunkered and well protected to this lovely little green. Let's see what we can do here. Chris, are you going to lead us away with Big Dog? Let's keep the attack running. Oh dear. That's not your best stuff. It's back on that path we was on earlier. Get trundling down that fairway. Oh, 
like that. Right, Chris, yours wasn't lying great, so I'm going to take mine just on the right hand side, and we have 85 playing 91. Oh, it's at 52 again. Just over that bunker, isn't it? Yeah. Short the aerial route again. I did it hit the shaft on the way up there. Oh, did it? Yeah, I don't know if the audio would have picked that up, but it's never happened to me before. Nice. Keep fading in. I'll tell you what, that could be really good, couldn't it? Could be close. Unfortunately, I didn't get the elusive divot hitting the shaft. I'll let you uh, put those back. Two cracking divots there. Mm. Pair of divots. Right, this is another chance that stopped nicely for me. Chris, has yours just released out a touch, unfortunately. You know what this is for, Chris? An own ball birdie. Ooh, I'll give the hole away. No movement, was they? No, that was a push. Part. Still five. Well, that's a wasted opportunity, that one. Okay, guys, 13th hole, 180 yard par three. This is stroke index 12. Lovely wall behind this protecting it. And a huge bunker on that left hand side. Let's attack this green, see if we can get to five and get the ball rolling for this back nine. It's a bit left of it. Smothered it. Hmm. Black like eye, we'll take the pills, positives. That's a good looking shot. Yep, nicely Keep coming going. down. Yeah, we'll take that. Nice fade in. Right, I've been getting confused. We are five under par. We have this to get to six. Just a lovely par three, really. You were, uh, you'd have had an interesting shot. Mm. A little bit of movement on this one. Really narrow green, isn't it? Long green. Mm. Started to turn and then straighten back. Yeah. Oh, exactly the same, wasn't it? Exactly the same. <clears throat> We're tapering. We could be really challenging here. We just need to start holding the putts, guys. We're playing the golf. Let's start holding the putts. That is five under par. A couple of holes left. Well, more than a couple. Okay, 14th hole, 340 yards. You can see this is incredibly well bunkered at your driver distance. Ideally here, imagine you're going to lay up at those bunkers, leave yourself a little bit of a longer shot in, then try and avoid those deep cavernous bunkers by the green. This looks absolutely gorgeous. Chris, let's take it away. Let's get the ball moving. It's on string with that firewood. Let's open the green up nicely. Yeah, that is perfect short of that left-hand bunker. Still teeing off here at Killspindy. Six o'clock in the evening. Beautiful night for it. Right, no real pressure here. Just send it down there the same. Like that. Oh. Right, we are going with Christopher's. Great shot, Chris. What we got? 102. It's the... Which green is it? Red that right-hand one. Red one. Yeah, not this one. I must admit, very impressed with this Seed SD05 golf ball. I've used this, well, since the second hole where we had that issue. Um, and it's lasted really well. Say how many wedge shots we've played as well. Not really a mark on it. A couple of little scuffs, but you'd expect that with any kind of ball. Yeah. And by the way, it's raining over in Edinburgh for anyone that is there. That is honestly delightful. I really hope you birded this by yourself. It's a great divot. I'll take the positives. Why are you think it's short? I don't know. Can't see. It's a little bit right, isn't it? Don't know. Oh, I'll stay up because the pace was all right. This was good. Where did you have it? Oh, I think I'm the same as you. 
Yeah, we let ourselves down with those approaches, really, didn't we? That's disappointing after that drive. In for par. Okay guys, 15th hole, 436 yards. This looks an absolute brute. Bunkers well placed on that right hand side as well. Thick rough on the left. You want to try and get on this hole in two with it being a par four. If you do go in that thick rough, you're going to struggle. Can we try and get that true turn in? We're five under par, we need something to happen. If we can knock Dunbar off the top of this leaderboard. Chris, let's have a big drive to start us off on this hole. Nice. Fading a bit, should be fine though. Similar. Yeah, both at the right side. Safe as houses though. Right, very lucky to finish short of this bunker on the right hand side. Chris, we've picked yours up, what have we got? 187. 187. Downwind a bit. I'm going to hit a nice five iron, try and really use that rough lie and flight it try and get a bit of a flyer see if we can get on this green give ourselves a birdie chance and what is the second hardest hole i think five's in it i've got four but i think five will get you there a good well you've been striking it well it's a great strike oh, stay there over the trap oh, that was such a good strike as well it's not over the trap. No. We'll keep coming in. Keep coming in. Yeah, nice. Very nice. Should be fringe. What club Pretty was that? Nice. Four iron. Four iron. Little bladed oh, number. You've been striking them. Amazing, haven't you? Take a bit out of that then. Beautiful. Right, my ball did finish in that bunker. I just got enchanted with that right hand flag, Chris. Mm, went for it. Mine did a bit of... Lee trundling down here onto the left side. Go on then, go on then. Oh, Chris Dennis, stop it. It's just you know, a shame worst... it was my drive because then it would have been anyway. The worst thing is, I actually thought that was the worst putt and worst stroke I've put on it all day, but, but sometimes that's just what you need in golf. It doesn't matter. That is six under par, three holes left. Can we birdie every hole? And can we get to the top of that leaderboard? Next 100. Come on! 16th hole, 410 yard par four, stroke index 14. Again, this is well bunkered, both down the left and the right side of this fairway. And again, well bunkered around that green. We are now on a roll. Let's birdie these last three. Let's get top of the leaderboard and let's do it now. Bring it back, let's do it now. Yeah. That's getting us fired up. I've took the wrong fairway. That is down the left fairway. I mean, I think that's a shortcut. I mean, that might be position A, because then you haven't got to go over the bunkers at the green as well. No, a terrible swing again. It was a tired golf swing, that, Christopher. Fatiguing here at Killspindy, but a delightful golf club. Oh, dear. It's social. That's even left of yours. I think you'll put a bit of a topspin lobber on it. <laughs> Is it time for the badger yet? Get those traces on then. Oh. Well, two shots down this fair. I mean, I'm actually in the left-hand rough of the left-hand hole, but it does massively open up that flag over there. We've got there. a gap between yeah, the Yeah, we've bunkers. got a gap between the bunk. Realistically, I think that should. Well, not really, because I don't like internal out of bounds, but you shouldn't be able to no, do that, should you? I don't like internal out of bounds either. We're very nearly in the sea again. Back with your first seed. <laughs> Just 136 in. I'm going to go with a full pitching wedge. Even though last time I did that, it went 200 yards. <clears throat> That's a 300 yard drive down the wrong fairway. Yeah. Right, come on. Not a time to throw one of them in. Gone long that as well, hasn't it? Long and right, whereas long and left off the tee. I think it's down to you, James. Nine iron? Yeah, just a, like a chippy one, hopefully. Shot I've been enjoying. I think it's caught a bit of the green yeah. or just off. We're not playing this hole 
to the best of our ability. Right, not the best. I think we'll take mine and try and give it a maybe chip in. Or if, I mean, if you can hold a putt like last time, that would be helpful. Mine was a terrible. It shot. Well, they were both bad shots. Actually. That wasn't a difficult shot. No. We overthought it a bit. This would be lovely. This is to get to seven. Oh, chipping. Yeah. Bit of a duff and run. I like she's playing there. <laughs> Has he got another? Has he got another? Oh no. Not bad. We'll have to settle for par. Okay guys, 17th hole, just two holes left. Can we make a few more birdies and get to the top of that leaderboard? 278 yards here, stroke index six. Amazing to see such a low stroke index for such a low yardage. Par four, can we get up there? You'll see how well, how well bunkered this hole is and a really crazy wall up that left-hand side as well. Chris, take it away, let's find a fairway. Up that right hand side, I think I found a really nice gap actually. Just found the path. Up the left, we seem to have found another little gap here. And this is a really interesting hole. You can see from the aerial footage that I don't really know what to do here, but how far have we got left in? 93. You're over on like the little pathway there. What do you want to oh. see in a bit? Can't believe I found that little slither of a gap so we can see whether. Flag is. Chris really wants this, I can tell. I've never seen him go up and check a whole location before. Ever. Right, we've been given the nod. No good. Uh, yours is a better angle, my friend. Okay, we'll go with that, shall we? How, how's it looking up there? I've never seen you look for a flag before. Well, just testing the angle. It's a bit closer to the right hand side of the green, so we need to find a delicate shot. How far is it? 90? 93. What have you got? 56, just a full one. Right. Is there anything around that flag? No, nope, just. The hole. He's gone for it. It's a one-handed finish. It is an absolute shocker, but it's hit a wall and <laughs> could be close. That's, he's bang on line. <laughs> it wasn't a very good. That was a shank, Chris. I'm going to go 52 with a Sky Forger double O ones. Oh, zero, zero, one. I bit off too much with that. I thought you did. Right. Flight one in there. Be the club, go on, get up. Oh, I'll tell you what, it looks like it could be. Could be good. Well, yours hit a wall, they got it right now, so we don't know. Mine's a three. Chris has turned up with a worldie. That's to get to seven. Mine did really well, actually. It should have been the other it, side of these walls, it but the wall. old farm walls, I believe they'll be yeah. up here. Tell you what, we've, not, we've timed this so well. It's just starting to rain. Is it? This is starting to rain. I said it wouldn't rain today. I thought it was one of them that looked like it pitched really close. Under there, someone hasn't done this one, so I'll do it for them. Must yeah. be mine, that. It was off that wall. <clears throat> right. Thanks for lining it up for me. Very kind of you. No problem, sir. Where have you got it? Right right edge. I've never looked actually, but there. Oh, it's never missed. Never missed, Christopher. That is a little sly fist pump. That's seven under. One to go. You tight sure. Why are we using a freshie? Okay guys, 18th hole, the finale. We need to eagle this hole to get to the top of the leaderboard, birdie it to tie the top with Dunbar. It is just a 250 yard par four stroke index 16. Name home, can we do it? Can we put it near that flag and give ourselves every chance of taking the lead? Oh, he's just turned it a touch. Such a shame. It is a shame. I think that's on the first tee, is it? Because that was the perfect distance and club. I've got three wood dinks too much. Can't be. No, I think it's perfect for you. 
in the three wood we trust. That's a nice control on that. Bit of a Jill Wilson knee drive. Don't Tell you what know. though, kick left, kick left. Oh! Is it bunker or grass bunker on the right hand side I think. It's a great effort. Down this 18th hole, what a hole this is. It really does make you think. It gets a little bit narrow down here. Obviously you've got the clubhouse and the pro shop. You can see my ball just there on the right hand side. Chris is down the left. I'm not far away from being out of bounds actually and it just shows you that That's I thought... That's what I I'd... saw just before I hit. Yeah, the OB. Mm. I just saw those women just really enjoying the cups of tea in the window and didn't fancy a seed SD05 straight through. On the wrong way here as well. Oh, they're not going to be happy with you. No, probably not. Oh dear, she's looking as well. At least it don't beat when you reverse. <laughs> they're absolutely ready. We're not held back now. I really enjoyed it today as well. And now we're banging. Yeah, we've had a good run. Anyway, guys, that's been killed Spindy. You'll never <laughs> see it again. <laughs> right, this shot right here is to go top of the leaderboard for Kill Spindy. The worst so for how enjoyable the course has been, it deserves it. Not that that's got to, anything to do with it, but and it's got a goose as its logo. That's a very good effort. Oh. These wedges are mint. <laughs> <laughs> that's the birdie. This to go top. Oh, come on, come on. Oh, what a shot, Chris. Mm -hmm. Well done, and that, he's tied top of the leaderboard. It's eight under for Kill Spindy Golf Club. Guys, thank you so much for watching. That has been a massively enjoyable day here. Chris, well played. Thank you very much. Guys, thank you for watching. Huge thanks to the guys at Tacoma and the guys at Seed Golf for supporting this journey. We could not be doing this without them. It's been amazing so far. Apart from that, I'll see you all the same time tomorrow. Goodbye.